And now on to our dinosaur of the day, Nomungaya, which was a request from Keegan. So thank you. And just as a quick reminder, we have had so many dinosaur requests lately that we do have to close it down for now to only people who are our patrons. And if you are a patron, go to patreon.com slash I Dino where we have details on how you can access all the dinosaurs that have been requested. We will be going through all the ones that were requested from non-patrons before, but but patron requests are prioritized and new requests must come for patrons. So quick reminder on that. And now back to Nomangaya. It was an oviraptorid theropod that lived in the Cretaceous in what is now Mongolia. And it was medium sized, is about 5.6 feet or 1.7 meters long and weighed 44 pounds or about 20 kilograms. It had this pygo style tail with five fused vertebrae. It probably had a feather fan. Yeah, that's what basically modern birds have is they have that pygo style where their tail feathers poof out like you think about an eagle or a hawk or something they have that little v-shaped thing or a peacock yeah i mean I that's, that's a pretty extreme, extreme example <laughs> <laughs> but yes they do also have a pygo style if you really wanted to think of what it might look like <laughs> i mean i don't think we've found what the feathers around the pygo style looked like on nomangaya so maybe it was like a peacock <laughs> you could <laughs> Yes. I was just saying as an example of pygo style. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of buried under the feathers on that one, though. Yeah, and it's the Nomangaya tail was shorter than most dinosaur tails, so I guess it probably wasn't like a peacock's. Well, that's the pygo style in general. It's like a few vertebrae that are fused mm. as like a short tail rather than just the long, you know, 40, 70 vertebrae oh, things sticking see, way I out see. there. Oh, I see, I see. See, now I just have peacocks in the, in the <laughs> head, so... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, Norman Gaia could have used its tail for display where maybe one bowed towards another and raised its tail. And then the one with the largest and best developed tail would be considered the most attractive, which I actually I think that is like peacocks. Yeah. And before Norman Gaia, this bone structure was only found in birds, the avium dinosaurs. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Norman Gaia would not have been able to fly, but it did have a beak and probably had a crest for display. The holotype was found in 1994 by the Mongolian-Japanese paleontological expedition in the Nemet Formation. They found a partial left leg, pelvic girdle, and most of the spine, and then it was described in 2000 by Barsbold and others. There's only one species, Nomangaya gobiensis, you know, because Mongolia. <laughs> the name refers to where the fossils were found, and Nomangin Gobi is a nearby part of the Gobi Desert. Oh, yeah. That really makes me not know how to say it. I had assumed that Gaia was like Gaia, the earth spirit sort of thing, but it's named after a place that's in Mongolian and it's also been Latinized. Mm -hmm. So pronunciation is anyone's guess. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So in many of these cases, we just do our best. <laughs> yeah. They very rarely give you a pronunciation guide in the paper. Yeah. So, yeah. But Nomen Gaia or... Nomingia, or however you want to say it. It's unclear what it ate. Other dinosaurs that lived in the same time and place include the Ornithomimosaur gallimimus, the Therizinosaur therizinosaurus, the Hadrosaur saurolophus, the Ankylosaur tarkia, the sauropod Nemectosaurus, Dromaeosaur adosaurus, the Troodont xanabazar, and Tyrannosaurs such as Alioramus and Tarbosaurus. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff in that Nemect formation. Mm hmm. And a lot of it is really cool. A lot of the most popular dinosaurs outside of Hell Creek. Oh, like yeah. Velociraptor, too. Is somewhere in the mix. Might not be that close, though. A little farther out, maybe. Gallimimus is pretty cool. Yeah, that's a good one. Also, the Therizinosaurus. That's just a weird <laughs> yeah, one. Yeah, it's a winner. <laughs> <laughs> 